Researchers say contaminated water from the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant could still be leaking into the port. They're calling for a thorough investigation. A team from Tokyo University of Marine Science and Technology has been studying the seawater in a port directly in front of the plant. Tests show levels of radioactive cesium exceed the government safety standard in some places. Researchers have calculated the total amount of radioactive substances in the port over a one-year period. They say about 16 trillion becquerels of cesium-137 may have leaked into the ocean since June 2011. That's 73 times the discharge limit imposed before the nuclear accident. Experts say that amount of contamination doesn't pose a threat to marine life in open waters, but radioactive substances could accumulate in fish in the port. Radioactive water began leaking into the ocean after the 2011 nuclear accident. Officials at Tokyo Electric Power took steps. They say the leak stopped three months later. Research team professor Jota Kanda says contaminated water may be leaking as groundwater. He says another possibility is damaged pipes in the compound. We need to look into every single possibility to verify the cause, if in fact contaminated water is leaking. TEPCO officials say they don't think radioactive substances are leaking. They say they will continue to investigate.